Hey guys, um, Connor McLeod here from the Glenelg Free Club. Um, here just to have a bit of a chat about First Nations Round um, and answer some of your questions. So my footy journey started um, probably later than everyone um, thinks. So I played soccer till I was about 15, 16. Um, I played a bit of school footy um, and some grasshopper stuff, but nothing too crazy up until then. Um, and then, yeah, went through the Woodville Academies, 16s, 18s, um, played some footy. Some senior footy there, I was lucky enough to make my league debut there last year. Um, and then yeah, was lucky enough to come across the Glenelg at the end of last year. And um, yeah, I've absolutely loved my time here. And being able to build relationships with um, new people um, and be able to work with um, players who have played at that next level um, and just pick their brains and yeah, just be able to better my, myself and my footy. I'm lucky enough to be able to, to make my debut this weekend um, for Glenelg. Um, yeah, it's, it's something that I've wanted to do for a long time now. Uh, since I've signed, um, it's been a yeah, pretty big goal of mine just to get an opportunity here at such an amazing footy club. And it's a privilege to be able to play in this round. Um, for me, um, you know, being able to pay honour to um, those past and, and present um, Aboriginal players um, and just yeah I guess be able to showcase my talents um, and yeah make hopefully make my family and my culture proud. My dad is obviously introduced he's from the, um, the Waterman and the Wagadagam um, communities up in uh, the NT uh, so I was actually lucky enough to design a Guernsey for Woodville a couple of years ago um, and be able to tell my story through that. It's been pretty special obviously <laughs> he's pretty well known around the place so yeah, just to be able to go to him when I need to talk, talk about things, like footy especially, um, really good for tips and that kind of thing, whether I like it or not. Um, but yeah, being able to speak to him, I guess, on a personal level and go to him whenever I need anything, yeah, it's, it's the main thing for me. I think just exciting players like Cyril um, and Buddy nowadays, like growing up, that was really who I watched. Um, but even now, seeing young blokes come through who I've played footy with, like Cozzy, um, and seeing what they're doing on a big stage is, yeah, it's just awesome. Yeah, to be able to make them proud, make my family proud, um, yeah, it's really important to me. I think seeing all the Guernsey designs, like everyone having their own Guernsey design is outstanding, and some of them are absolutely incredible. I would love to wear all of them. <laughs> um, but I guess, yeah, seeing the girls, all the girls wear theirs this year as well um, through the, the Sample W was awesome as well. And just, uh, I guess, the um, rap plan that the Sample has just launched is it's an amazing thing. It's something that I guess we've been hoping for for a long time. So seeing steps um, implemented there to I guess, take the next stage in the, in the Sample path is that yeah it's awesome. There's always things that we can improve on um, as a community we're probably never gonna completely wipe everything but I guess just being able to call out things now um, and and have the support of people behind you is, is really important for us. The the amount of um, racism cases that I've had has gone up but it's a positive thing because it means more people are speaking out about it. Um, so yeah, I think it's really important, even though the numbers are going up, that we are able to kind of have those discussions and conversations and help people through that, which is, yeah, awesome. It's gonna be an amazing day. I'm, yeah, like I said before, very lucky and privileged to be playing, not only in such a special round, but making my debut for the club. So yeah, it'd be awesome to see everyone down there and um, get behind us on such a special day.